Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So in this video, we are going to discuss how you can create a quiz uh, for your institution. So let's say you are a teacher, you are a tutor and you want to take a test of your uh, a student. So obviously you will go with the MCQ if you want. Okay. And uh, second scenario, let's say uh, you want to organize queues for your uh, employees or your colleagues. Okay. So how you can do it. So the easiest way is to go with the Microsoft forms. Okay. So uh, I'm going to show you how you can create the quiz with the help of Microsoft forms. Okay so you need to open office first okay so make sure this office is installed on your desktop or laptop okay and then you need to search for forms okay now i simply want to create a quiz right so i will be clicking on this one so as you have already seen i have uh, some set of questions here okay so uh, these are the questions which i'm going to uh, make it a form of a quiz and uh, I, you can share this quiz with anybody and they can uh, uh, like attempt this quiz and they can see their answers as well okay so uh, this is the untitled quiz so you can name it anything so let me name it as demo quiz okay so what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a quiz and then I will be sending the link and I will be attempting the quiz from the other window so that you guys can see the score okay so let's add here so you can add uh, the choice text rating date anything okay so i want to go with the choice okay so i will be going with the choice first so here it is asking to enter the question first so let me just uh, take the question from here okay and then i have to put the answers also right so uh, what are the answers i have uh, 36 48 4.8 3.6 okay so let me just put it here 36 48 3.6 and then 4.8 you can put as many options as you want okay but i'm going with the four options as of now now let's see you want to make uh, one of the options as the correct one right so obviously if you see this our 48 is the correct answer right so we can make this 48 as the correct one so rest other are wrong okay so when someone is attempting and they click on the 48 uh, they are going to get one a score so point is something that uh, you can uh, give it here so i want uh, one question for five marks so i can give it as five okay now let's add uh, another question so take the question from here and the option are 4.4 2.8 something like this right okay so 4.4 2.8 i just want the right answer okay so i can keep anything for the other options so let's say 0 0.4 and then can be 3.7 okay uh, so what we have the correct one as 4.4 i believe right yep so here comes the next question so let me just uh, complete that as well so by default uh, this one is also going to be of having five points if you want to change you can change it uh, okay other thing is like uh, if you want to have multiple answers okay so there, there is a chance that uh, some of the questions have multiple answers so in this case you can click this checkbox in and you can select other options as well okay so you can select this as well so if they click uh, this one this two they are going to get the score okay but i do not want this to be the multiple answer so let it be So this is the correct answer okay that's done now i can do i can see the preview also this okay because uh, this is auto saved okay you no need to save it so if you see the preview this is the preview okay so this is how people will get it now let me do one thing let me show you after attempting this okay so this is how it will look like in computer in mobile it will look like this okay so let me go to the computer and try to attempt it okay so the first question uh, what was the right answer 48 so it will uh, show you the score at the end of the quiz right so here 4.4 and let me just uh, intentionally make it wrong okay and then submit so your answer has been submitted successfully you can check your score now okay so you need to click on the view results okay so if you see your points are 10 by 15 so this is how you can see the score uh, there is one more feature here 
so if you see you can send it uh, to anybody else okay or if you want you can change the theme also so you can make uh, any theme you can change it to anything actually okay okay so this is one thing and other thing is like if you have created the quiz right so you can see how many people have attempted this quiz in the response section okay so if you see uh, you have got one response for this quiz okay so what i will do now is i will try to attempt this quiz from the other window so let me send it so just copy this url let me open this in incognito okay right so let me just attempt this here 48 point eight this one submit okay I can see the result so I have a score 5 out of 15 okay so this is done now if I go there and check uh, I can see there are two responses okay see I got two responses right so uh, two people have attempted this question so this is how guys you can create the quiz and uh, send it to anybody uh, who you want uh, them to attempt it okay so thank you for watching the video if you like this kind of content please do subscribe the channel and share the content with your friends okay till the next video till then bye bye take care